Hey guys, welcome to RPA feed and in today's session, we'll be looking at PGP package in A360. So let's get started with this. First of all, I would like to throw some light on what is PGP. PGP is pretty good privacy. What does that mean? It's an encryption program that provides cryptographic privacy and authentication for data. So PGP is used for signing, encrypting, decrypting files, emails, um, directories, etc. So it was developed by Phil Zimmerman in the year 1991. So this is the person who developed it. The question arises, right? Why exactly we need it? We need PGP when security is our main concern. We are dealing with sensitive and confidential data and we need something fast and simple yet reliable source for encryption and decryption, right? So when you're transferring files or your bot is processing some files, but you want to ensure that there is a security is not compromised or you're dealing with sensitive data. So you can always encrypt the information, creating public and private keys. We will be looking at those in uh, our example. So this is why we need PGP, pretty good privacy. And there, these are some pros and cons of using PGP in general. It's not about PGP package yet. We'll, we will talk about PGP package or how to use PGP package in a while. Uh, this, is, this is in general concept of PGP. So uh, pros are like it's secure, fast, and uh, you can it's selective. You can use it only when you need it. It's not uh, you. It's not that you need to enforce or uh, use all the algorithms every every time. It's a plug and play system. So the cons are limited security. Uh, it it cannot provide all the security you need. Uh, but yeah, it's it's handy. You can uh, it's it's still secure, but uh, cannot protect all your uh, cannot be used for all your uh, encryption uh, and decryption needs so it's uh, it require both the parties to participate yeah obviously you need to create a public key and you need to create a private key so the sender who has uh, or the receiver who has the private key will only be able to encrypt the data and see it right with uh, for the data which you have encrypted using public key if you want a session on encryption and dec uh, decryption mechanism and how that works in general you can comment down below this video and we will have a session on it and fragile can't be misplaced or forget uh, can't misplace or forget your private key if you if there is a private key which is uh, generated and you need to store it somewhere and you need to uh, you need to secure uh, securely store it so that you can use it for the decryption We'll see this uh, in action, then it will make sense. So this is about pretty good privacy package in Automation Anywhere A360 platform. So we have PGP package and then we have three different actions, uh, create keys, decrypt files and encrypt files. So create keys action helps you to create public and private keys. Decrypt files is used to decrypt the already encrypted files suppose you have encrypted one file you can decrypt that file using this action and encrypt file action uh, encrypts the file using the one of the encryption algorithm we'll see all these in uh, a demo so create keys create keys action is uh, simple and you just need to specify two of the locations uh, like your public key and private key location and it will generate the keys and you can just uh, um, password protect your private key as well then we have encrypt files so encrypt files is a uh, has certain sections in it uh, when you use encrypt file action you have to specify the encryption type wherein you can use passphrase or public key so you we generated one public key in the previous action right we can use that public key over here to encrypt our file or we can also use passphrase which allows you to use the credentials uh, in secure string right then we can choose the al in, uh, encryption algorithm which we want to use for uh, encrypting the file so there are a list of available uh, encryption algorithms like aes128 bluefish triple des right for this example, we'll be using triple DS. These are different uh, encryption algorithms available for uh, uh, available inside a PGP package. 
So here you can specify the source folder or file and destination folder or file. Source folder or file will be the file which you need to encrypt and destination folder will have the file which is once the file is encrypted it will be stored over there. And then uh, we have an encrypt compression uh, type. So compression type can be selected uh, to zip file you want to create or Z lib file, right? Or none of the file. Like if you do specify none, the compression won't be done. Your file won't be compressed. And you may also check that armor data uh, checkbox to enable your ASCII armor. What is ASCII armor? It's binary to textual encoding converter. Uh, by default one of the feature of PGP then we have decrypt file decrypt file are used to decrypt the uh, uh, encrypted file right so here we will be using the private key for decryption so again in encryption type you can use paraphrase or private key uh, the one which you have created right we can use that private key as well over here and same we can specify the source folder and destination folder source folder will be the of encrypted file which you want to decrypt and the destination folder contain your de decrypted file you can override the files by checking that box and you can also remove the file extension and then let's watch the demo let's head over to bot editor window here I have already created a simple bot. Uh, once you open the window, you can type PGP and you will get the uh, PGP package. And at the moment, these are the three action uh, available inside the PGP package, which we have already covered in our slides. So pretty good privacy package. This is create key uh, using this method. Uh, using this action you can create a public and private key so I'll let me let me pull up the uh, folder where I have created these keys so here uh, this is the source file the source file contains some random text in this case uh, it can be business information it can be PDF file it can be Excel file which uh, which has a lot of sensitive data in it for this demo I have taken just a text file and I have just written a sample text in this so uh, the goal is uh, we want to encrypt this file so that no one should be able to read the text uh, what is uh, whatever data it's present inside this file the only authorized person or the person who has the private key will only be able to decrypt this information and read this file so uh, we will be applying the uh, encryption uh, and decryption mechanism on this file using PGP package so this keys folder will hold uh, the private key and public key which are which will be generated uh, via this uh, action so once we run the bot the public key and private key will be generated and then once we uh, use this encrypt action uh, right encrypts uh, encrypt action we use the, that generated uh, public key over here for encrypting our file the file will be, will be encrypted and will be stored inside this encrypted file folder so these are all the same uh, uh, options which I, we have already discussed. See, we can check this armor data as well, but it's not needed as of now here. And the decrypt file, uh, decrypt file action will allow you to decrypt the file using the private key. Here we specify private key, but for encryption we specify public key. Okay, and the, the rest of the thing is same we can remove the extension of the file as well if we suppose if we know the extension of the file like PDF file we can remove that or any other file also we can remove that so now let me show you uh, the folder and let let me run this bot so here we have the source file okay so let's run the bot a bot has run successfully let's see the output in the folder so we have the keys the keys were created this is the public key so this is how the public key looks like and similarly this is the private key and here if we if we go here our source file dot text is this is our input file so this file was encrypted now and we can see that data this is the encrypted data so no one can view it uh, like no one can recognize this part right what what data it was so this is the in, uh, encryption uh, mechanism uh, the file is encrypted now the the intended user or the authorized user 
to read that file we need to decrypt that file so that the file can be decrypted using the private key and this is that this is the file which was decrypted and here we got the text what what was there in the, the decrypted file so that's the whole purpose of uh, using pgp package for encryption and decryption mechanism on your uh, for your file and that's all guys thank you for watching this video hope you understood the concept if you have any concerns please comment down below please feel free to subscribe to our channel share this video and thanks for watching